家游戏。弟弟是。You want some more coffee? No,、oh, no thanks. I should get going. What? You just got here. Did you need to talk to me about something? Well, yeah. No, no. I not really. Okay, whatever. I've known you for too long. I can tell when something's bothering you. Okay. It's it's just that my life doesn't have a whole lot of direction right now. Well, no one's does. Well, that's not true. You're really busy with with Maria and your new job and with Fox. And what do I do? I don't have a job or a relationship. I'm worried about Jessica. Jessica's gonna be fine. My dad got her away from that low life spike, didn't he? I guess so, for the moment. What? Wait, is she gonna go back to that jerk? I mean, I don't know. It's it's all really messed up and complicated. And you know, Whitney's in a convent, and my parents split up. So how's your dad doing? I don't actually know. He's not speaking to me. What? Why not? What happened? You haven't heard? Heard what? Oh, I just figured with Jessica and her Look, big mouth. Look, whatever it is with your dad, I'm sure it's gonna work out. Believe me, ever since I've had Maria, there's two sides to the old parent-child relationship business. And look, I'm sure whatever you did, he'll calm down. He'll be fine. He loves you. You watch. Once you find the right man, and you get married, and you have babies, you will totally understand what it means to really love your child. I'm never gonna meet a man and get married. Well, <laughs> who knows? Maybe I'll get married, but well, one sort of goes with the other. <laughs> Here it comes. Simone's about to drop the lesbo bomb again. I'm never going to get married to a man because I'm gay. Gay? I'm a lesbian. Oopsie. This is unbelievable. Okay, I knew it. You you hate me, just like my dad, just like Jessica. You know what? This is what I get for being honest. Okay, would you would you calm down? You cannot drop a bomb on me like that and expect me not to react to it. It's a shock. Yes, but I don't hate you. You don't. No. Why would you think that? Oh well, I just figured after the way Jessica and my dad reacted. Well, I'm that sure you it was just a, a big shock to your dad. And as far as Jessica goes, she's not exactly the poster child for mental health lately. She'll come around. I'm just pissed you didn't tell me before. Well, I was scared, and and you've been really busy with your own life, so. Oh, I'm really sorry that I haven't been there for you. Well, I'll be there from now on, okay? You can always count on me, okay? You have no idea how much that means to me. Hey, you're my best friend. I love you. Well, not like that. <laughs> Human friendship, really rather revolting. What's that? Um. Well, you know, Kay is an experience, but I think you're wrong about her computer skills. I mean, she's actually very, very good. So, yeah, you know, I thought I'd give her a crack at the graphics package for the Singapore Investors Report. Oh, no, no. That's difficult work. If Kate does a good job on that, it'll bolster Fox's confidence in her. That's nice of you. No, no, it has nothing to do with being nice. I just need to find out how Kate can best serve this project. God, must be that damn virus. Kay's virus? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta stop before it ruins everything. I, I can't do anything. I can't even access the antiviral scan. Look at this. Nothing's working. The whole thing's. Wait, let me try. I just thought of something. There, there it is. Valerie, you're amazing. So, so can the can the virus spread?、Uh. 
That can't happen because there isn't any virus. Nope, I logged off in time. There. It's been totally eradicated. Yeah? <sighs> Whoa! I mean to tell you, I almost had a heart attack there. I thank God you were here. Uh, anyone with decent computer skills would have fixed that problem. I couldn't. I'm sure you would have figured it out in a minute. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I don't know, Valerie. Not everyone could save the day like you just did. Thank you. Are you talking about poor King and... The girl works so hard. It's not her fault she's underqualified for her position. She doesn't even have an undergraduate degree. Well, neither do I. But you have so much experience. And you're a crane. Business is in your genes. I think you need to be really kind to Kay. Why don't you give her some time to learn the ropes? In a few years, she could be invaluable to you.